So I think one of the advantages of tr building trust and, and having lines of communication is clarity. So very often I thought as, a, as an enforcement person that people didn't really understand why we were asking for things or what the effect of it was and they got extremely defensive about things that didn't need to be defensive and that creates that entrenched relationship which starts to uh, become very hard to move forward and, and you need to find ways to overcome that. So the more dialogue there is, the more confidence there is in each other's position, the easier it is in fact to respond to a question because you know what's behind it, you're not panicking, you don't feel like it's a trap. And that works both ways. The agency will be concerned not to be missing a trick when it's investigating, and they would be worried that if they ask a narrow question and the smoking gun answer to their questions outside the parameters of the question, and they didn't yield that information, then they would be not doing their job properly. So they need to be confident that they are um, doing their work in a way that's going to yield all the right information. And that does come down to that trust. So, you know, as an advisor, you would want, want to be able to say you don't need to ask a blanket question that's going to take us two years to analyse the data, because you can take it from us that if you ask a narrower one, but we understand that there's an important point just on the parameters of that, that will be brought to your attention anyway.